we have a California bill that was set to ban what they call fake news pulled in California because they say it would go against free speech. This is the problem with all this, though, is they can sit here and they can draw up these bills about fake news, but this will never be applied to your mainstream establishment-controlled media. Do you understand that? The only time they go out labeling anything fake news is alternative media. It is the weapon that they have created to go after anything that is a problem for them. Anything with truth, substance, and of course, they'll set up psyops along the way to ticker tape to this to use as an excuse or an example of fake news. And then they'll try to stick people in that basket, even though they don't believe in some of the information that is being pushed there. It's all a ploy, part of the PSYOP, to censor you, to take away your freedom of speech. And apparently some individuals in California seen this. They were like, this isn't going to happen. You're not going to do this. It's going to go against, against free speech. It's going to be disastrous for free speech. So they ended up talking to the guy, Ed Chow, the guy that brought this up, Assembly Bill 1104, the California Political Cyber Fraud Abatement Act. He pulled it at the 11th hour. They may revise this, is the thing that you need to pay attention to. We've talked about the guns. We've talked about vaccines. Everything else in California, taking away people's rights. If people sit back and do nothing and allow them to establish a bill like this that says whatever they don't deem to be real is fake, that's very dangerous. You see, the whole reason for journalism is to have individuals going out here finding the truth, reporting on things that the establishment-controlled mainstream media does not. And sometimes that can get dangerous. Bottom line is this. They are in a full-blown assault mode to go after the truth. That's what it should read here. Like I said, the mainstream media pumps out loads of fake news on the daily and never will any of these bills ever be applied to them. That's the thing. They never are. I mean, do you see ABC coming out and going after Fox every week saying you're pushing fake news? Or do you see Fox going after CNN? You may have seen one or two articles. If so, I'd like to see them. But a majority of this is geared toward the alternative independent media, the truth that they put out that is not controlled, that isn't being, you know, handled by the powers that be. Before they, they put it out there, this is why you turn into the mainstream news and you see the same repeated stuff. doesn't matter if it's Oklahoma, Atlanta, Cincinnati, California. I've shown it before. The same script repeated across the country. For that little bit of time, they give you uh, your, your global news. So, that's where it sits right now with this bill. I think it's important that people realize what's happening here in Cali. If you turn a cheek to it, they're just going to come back with another bill amended to where they can slip it through. So, you know, what is fake news? Fake news is anything that a handful of them are deeming to be fake. In, in all reality, it could be very, very, very real. Nine times out of ten, I believe it is. And you have to be prepared for these psyops that they put into motion to try to catch individuals up and... uh label you as fake news, but it's not going to stop. Anytime you have any hard-hitting truth that you're putting out there that they don't like, this is what they're going to label it. I'll leave a link. I'll update with more as I come across it. It's been Dabu7.